The global climate crisis is changing Kansas as we know it and upending my generation's assumptions about a future in our home state. As things are shaping up, my generation will be growing into a transformed Kansas, a state scarred by natural disasters, submerged by floods, and shaken by environmental instability. It is deeply distressing that though the effects of climate change are already happening, alarming numbers of adults refuse to acknowledge the problem. Perhaps the issue still seems theoretical to them. Perhaps they believe the expertise and consensus of scientists around the world are up for debate. But for Kansans my age, the climate crisis is an impending reality. What year were you born? I was born in 02. So from as early as you remember, climate has been an issue? Yeah, I mean, I think like with Al Gore, you know, in 2000 and him really kind of making it about, you know, like, like one of the central tenets of his platform. Ever since then, it kind of has been like, you know, like in the political sphere. And that's kind of where I learned from it. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's sort of just always been kind of in the back of my mind, something that I've been aware of. How do you think that sets you apart from people 20, 30 years older than you are? Most people my generation tend to accept climate change as like a fact. and I don't really encounter that in, in you know people 20 30 years older than me who you know some of them just don't believe in it or just like haven't grown up you know with it kind of understood as a fact I mean people my generation some of them probably disagree about what to do about it and maybe some of them don't believe in it but largely I think like it's just something that you kind of accept as like true um, and that may be something uh, a product of like the social spheres that I'm in but also I just think generally like, yeah, there's, the skepticism extends more heavily um, in the older generations. The science is settled and the warnings are clear. Older generations will see the first effects of this crisis and my generation will suffer through it. We are in immediate danger and there is a narrowing window for action. As each day passes, the possibilities for a sustainable future diminish. Those of us whose future is being determined before we have the political or financial clout to determine for ourselves feel the clock ticking. The problem isn't completely unfixable, but we have to act. I wish I could say the outlook is hopeful, but it isn't, and for my generation, it's hard to be optimistic.